Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Once again, we're continuing our NFL tier list series and today you may notice that I've been wearing this Cowboys jersey for a couple of the past few videos and I consider this to be one of the one of the greatest um, NFL jerseys of all time. It's just really great. I love this Cowboys jersey. And uh, today I figured why not rate some other jerseys. We're going to be ranking all the home jerseys from the 2022 NFL season. And if you guys do enjoy this, I will rate the away ones next video. Well, before we get into the rankings, I'll give you guys the um, tiers of my list. At the top, we have Amazing, then we got Solid, then we got Average in the middle, and then we have Nah below that, and then at the worst, we got Oh God No, What Is That at the bottom. So let's get into this list, and we'll start off with the New York Jets. They have this all green with a little bit of white outlining, um, and you got New York and some solid white numbers. I like the green, um, you don't see too many green teams. You got the Eagles and the Jets and that's about it. And I think green can work um, if it's done right. These aren't ugly, I don't think they're atrocious, but we'll put it in, uh, we'll put in an average. It's not bad, but it's not amazing. Now we have the Atlanta Falcons and their home jerseys are these all black jerseys, which I'm not a huge fan of. Um, you got the ATL above the number. Um, and no really like clear logos. Um, I think all black was a bit of a mistake. They should have a little bit more red in there. I think we'll put it in nah. It just, it just doesn't have the look to it that they're going for. And then if you guys have been watching a while, you know I'm not a huge fan of anything to do with the Commanders. And uh, I don't think their jerseys are great either. You kind of have like a mustard and ketchup look going on here. You got a lot of red and a little bit of yellow. And just, I think the tones of the colors are just off. And it, like I said, it looks like ketchup and mustard. They're gonna put this in, oh God, now at the bottom. Then you got the Jaguars. Um, I think the Jaguars actually have a pretty good um, theme going on here. You got the light blue. It's almost like a teal. Um, I think if they had a little more like yellow or gold from the Jaguar, they'll look better. But I'd say they're decent. They're, they're going to go in average. Then we got the Tennessee Titans. Actually, like there's a lot as well. Um, you got a solid blue with little baby blue um, outlines. And then Titans above the number. Um, nothing amazing. We'll put an average again. So far, none of them are great, but they're all all right. Then we got the Broncos, um, orange, you don't see that a lot. You got the Bengals and I guess the Broncos. Um, I think they make the orange work. The orange and the navy blue looks really good together. Um, and it, it's all right, we'll put it in solid. I think it's a good combo here. Then we got the Texans. Um, I do like the red and blue here. Um, I think if they threw in a little white outlining around the red, it would look even better. But I think they got a good thing going on. We'll put that in solid. So then we have the Seahawks, and I haven't played Madden in so long, but back in the day, I always used to play as the Seahawks because I loved their jerseys, and they just were really good on that game. Um, but I really like their colors they got. I think the dark blue with the um, neon green just goes super well together. And I think this will be our first one in Amazing at the top. Then we have the Eagles. Um, Eagles are solid too. That's the other green team I was talking about. I think if they threw in a little bit more white, it would look even better, but it's a lot of like black outlining. And uh, I'd say those are solid. They're definitely iconic jerseys. Then we got the Cardinals. I'm um, not a huge fan of their home ones. I think these could have been better. Um, it's pretty much all red, just with a little bit of white in there. Um, honestly, kind of disappointing in the Cardinals home jerseys. We'll put it in not. And then we have the Detroit Lions. Definitely a different shade of blue, I feel like, than what they've had in the past. They got a lot of gray, and I think that kind of works against it. I think white would have looked better for the outlining. Um, and then there's not really any Lions logo. I think a Lions logo would look better on the jersey, maybe here. Uh, we'll put it in, we'll put it in not, not a huge fan. Then we got the Ravens. I think uh, purple is really unique for a NFL jersey and I really like their jerseys here. Um, just a little bit of gold outlining. I think a little more gold would have made it great, but they're solid, we'll put them in solid. Next up are the Carolina Panthers. And something about the Panthers home jerseys, it just looks off to me. They look almost like, I don't describe it, they look like knockoff kind of. Like, it just doesn't look as good as it could. I think it's the stripes that kind of throw me off here. And then you have the numbers on the inside, which is really interesting. I'm um, not a huge fan. I think we'll put those in. Oh God, no, I don't like those. Next up are the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. I think theirs are really classic. Pretty much all red here, which is a little bit of black, um, but not much to say about them besides that I like them. We'll put it in solid. Then we got the Cleveland Browns. I've roasted them in the past about their logo and um, their mascot. And uh, I don't know, just I think any team name, like just the Browns is boring, like it's a boring name. And they have like no good logo, it's just an orange helmet. 
and brown for a jersey just doesn't look great. Um, I think brown and orange could work, but just something about it looks bad. We'll put in Oh God No at the bottom. Moving down, we have the New England Patriots. I really love their theme. Got the red, white, and blue. America right there. Um, pretty classic jerseys here for them. All navy blue and they got the red and white stripes. I think theirs is really solid. Minnesota Vikings next. Um, a purple jersey. I like it. I think purple works. Um, purple, white, and gold. Really good combination there. And uh, yeah, I, I like these. I like these jerseys. We're putting solid. And you got the Indianapolis Colts. Um, I think they're dark blue. Well, it's more like a royal blue and white. Looks really good together. Um, pretty simple, but I like these simple jerseys. And I think we'll put that in solid. Then we got the Cincinnati Bengals. Here's one of the first all black jerseys that I think works really well. Something about orange and black together just looks amazing. And you got like the stripes, like almost like claw marks from the Bengals on the, the uh, shoulder pads. I think we'll put these in amazing. I really like the look of these. And the white pants look really good with that. Then you got the Dolphins, very much um, teal here, and I think the Dolphins have some amazing jerseys. Um, really good theme, and I really like their logo. I think we'll put Dolphins in amazing. Then we got the LA Rams, um, really like theirs as well. Um, not a huge fan of their logo, it definitely got more simplified, but I think the yellow and the blue works really well together. I will put them in solid. New York Giants up next, pretty much all blue here. I think they could use a little more red in their jersey, but um, the blue is pretty simple, pretty basic. We'll put it in average, not awful, not amazing. Buffalo Bills also have some really good jerseys here. I think the red, white, and blue just always works well. Um, full blue here, but it's like a royal blue. And then you have some red and white stripes. I think those work really well together and we'll put them in amazing. And now we have nine jerseys left here. Gonna get into some really iconic ones. The Green Bay Packers up next with some really iconic jerseys. Yellow and green, maybe you don't think it could work well together, but I think they have some of the most iconic NFL jerseys. And um, it's it's just, it's the Packers. I think those are great. We'll put them in amazing. Then you got the Chicago Bears, which surprisingly, theirs are pretty decent. Um, you got like a navy blue. It's really dark blue. And then you have some orange stripings, which I think works. We'll put it, we'll put it in solid. Um, New Orleans Saints, really good jerseys as well. I think the black and gold looks amazing. I just like the gold on these jerseys. We will put the Saints in solid. Definitely like their theme going on. Then we have the Pittsburgh Steelers, black and yellow. They even wrote a song about that. Really classic, black and yellow. We'll put them in amazing. Um, all solid black and then the yellow stripes on the pads I think just looks iconic. But I think the pants is what really makes it amazing. The yellow pants just goes really well. Kansas City Chiefs, straight red. And then you got some gold and white in there. And I think they got a great look as well to them. Do we think the Chiefs are going to win the Super Bowl? I predicted them to win it before the playoffs started. So will they beat the Eagles? We'll see. But one thing's for sure, they have amazing jerseys. And then we have the Las Vegas Raiders. Um, a lot of their players can't stay out of jail. They're not a great team this year, but they definitely have some amazing jerseys. It's really simple, just black and white. And then you have the silver pants, but I think it works really well together. We'll put them in amazing as well. And the Dallas Cowboys. I like theirs. Um, no surprise, I'm a Cowboys fan, but I really like this one. And some of their other jerseys have been better in the past. Um, kind of boring, not gonna lie. It's all white and then blue stripes. It's definitely like simple and bold and iconic, but it's um, it's not their best jerseys. We'll put them in solid though. You have the Los Angeles Chargers. Um, they actually have some really great jerseys as well. I really like the, it's like a royalish, um, like baby blue, but a little darker. And then the yellow and white striping looks great with theirs. And then they have gray pants with like a bolt on them, which I think that's a nice touch. Um, I like theirs, we'll put them in solid. And then finally, the last team, we got the San Francisco 49ers. Fortunately, they took care of the Cowboys like it was nothing. Um, but that will not stop me from ranking their jerseys as really good. I think we'll put theirs in solid. So that wraps up another NFL tier list. Hope you guys enjoy all the football content. We're just wrapping them all up as we get closer to the Super Bowl. Really like making these videos. If you guys enjoy watching them, make sure to like and subscribe down below. And we'll see you next time where we rank the away jerseys. See you.